In this lesson, we learn how to find an inverse function. The inverse function is written as f to the minus 1 of x. To find it, we first write f of x as y, then replace each x with a y and vice versa. Then, rearrange this equation for y. Finally, write y as f to the minus 1 of x. For example, find the inverse function of f of x equals 5x minus 2. We first write y equals instead of f of x equals. We then replace x's with y's and y's with x's. y becomes an x and x becomes a y. The rest of the equation stays the same. Now we rearrange this equation for y. We want y equals. We add 2 to both sides of the equation. We have x plus 2 and we just have 5y on the right hand side. Now we divide by 5. We get x plus 2 over 5 equal to y. Finally, we write y as f to the minus 1 of x, as this is our inverse function. Find the inverse function of f of x equals the square root of 2x plus 3. We write y equals the square root of 2x plus 3. We replace y with x and x with y. We now rearrange this equation for y. y is inside a square root, so we square both sides. We get x squared and the square root is removed on the right hand side. Now we need to subtract 3, then divide by 2. We get x squared minus 3 over 2 equals y. Finally, we write the inverse function equals x squared minus 3 over 2. Find the inverse function of f of x equals x cubed minus 2. We write y equals x cubed minus 2. We replace y with x and x with y. We rearrange for y. We first add 2 to remove the minus 2. We get x plus 2 equals y cubed. We now cube root to remove the cube. We get the cube root of x plus 2 equals y. We write the inverse function equals the cube root of x plus 2. Find the inverse function of f of x equals x plus 4 over 2x minus 1. We write y equals. We replace y with x, x with y, and this x with y. Every x must be replaced with a y. Now we rearrange to get y equals. We multiply both sides by 2y minus 1 to remove the denominator of the fraction. We get x times 2y minus 1. And we are left with y plus 4. Now we expand this bracket to get 2xy minus x. Now we collect all y terms together and move everything else to the other side of the equation. We will keep 2xy where it is. But we will add the x to the other side 
as it does not contain a y. We will subtract the y from the right hand side so that it is on the left hand side with the 2xy. We leave the plus 4 on the right hand side as it does not contain a y. Now we factorise the y. We will leave x plus 4 on the right hand side as it is. We bring y out to leave 2x minus 1 in the brackets. We now divide by the 2x minus 1 in the brackets to leave us with y on the left hand side of the equation. We get y equals x plus 4 over 2x minus 1. We just write this as the inverse function equals x plus 4 over 2x minus 1. Visit mathsathome.com for further videos and practice.